Guys, this is crazy. There's people. I don't even know how many people here. A thousand people. More. More. It's like, there's like <laughs> bumper to bumper traffic. Yeah. It's so fun though. The weather is perfect today. It's like perfect overcast garage sale weather. And we are so prepared. We have our highlighter. We have our recycled totes to carry the things. I already got my sun hat on. It's not even sunny. Yet. I know, but we're ready. Um, and they even have like stations around here. This is the best neighborhood garage sale because they have porta potties. They have places where you can get water. Um, lots of people have snacks if you if you have a hankering. <laughs> and then we can go down this turn. And then there's a whole bunch on that road. Mom's planning out our turns here. So do you want to go straight and get those three or do you yeah. want to turn now? We should probably just hit go, these three. That's ten houses. You have to go and down. then do this loop. Because those were good. Yeah, that by fountain court was good. Yeah. Okay, well, do I do down. remember last year my least favorite portion was, was over this here. area. Was yeah. Over, yeah. So we'll go down and get that's ten houses down, then turn. Yeah. Come back. Okay. This is a big one. Are you ready? Is your heart going boom boom? <laughs> Found a Sherman blanket. She, she doesn't buy anything for me anymore. It's all for Sherman. <laughs> look how beautiful it is. This. I don't know. That's pretty. Wow! Cool. Look at those ones too. What I have to know what these are. Those are beautiful. Look at that and the dark red ones over there. I just love admire and they, look at the lamb. This lady has great plants. Look at this one right <laughs> I love your plants on the side of the house. What are those ones that look like a big foxtail looking thing? Uh, they're called a pineapple lily. Okay, pineapple lily. lily. Yes. Wow. And uh, there's a, a grower. Uh, I got them out at, you know, are you familiar with Seabrights? No. Seabrights, okay. so they have ferns and hostas. And okay. They bring people in who are growers and hybridizers and that's for it goes to Where is that? Is that it's, it, yes, actually it is uh, to go out uh, to... Uh, 99, uh, W, 99W. You cross over at Chamawa okay. and then you go uh, turn on 99W going north oh. and then you'll see a sign that says Seabright. It, it's S-E-B-R-I-G-H-T. Okay. It's a fabulous nursery. Oh, neat. So, did you buy them as a bulb or were they in a little pot? They, they, they were a plant. Yeah, to go over the dress. top of, yeah. yeah. Wow. All that that's work. pretty. Yeah. Yes, it does. I'd go with that. Um, oh, that's tatting. This. That's Congress. Yeah, that's really yeah, that's really that's really that's really that. Oh, I got the top of the truck. car. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, we're going to that nursery. Yeah. Pineapple lilies. That's cool. Mm -hmm. butterfly dress. It's <laughs> cute. Yeah. Yep. Mom pointed this out. It's like a little shabby chic baby. Yeah, the print's pretty. <laughs> it has like a, it just is really flattering on. 
I love jumpsuits too. I was kind of hoping it was a jumpsuit. I just love like the drama. I got the cute patchwork coat. I feel like this is so adorable. I'm probably gonna pop this on my website like after I wear it a few times. It's so cute. And then she brought out a shoe box of jewelry like when I was checking out at the table. So I grabbed these two, I wanna say grab, I paid for them. <laughs> yep. These two really pretty pieces. This is like a turquoise like nugget and garnet, almost like a squash blossom design to it. Really pretty. And then this one's like from the 60s. It's signed, I, I couldn't read it. I'll have to get my little loop out, but it's a signed like 60s enamel piece I thought was really neat. And I got a free flower pot. Yeah. I look in the free pile. <laughs> Look how far we went. Yeah. You know what we should have done is we should have turned our phones on and they can like GPS yeah, track. Steps. Yeah, how far we've walked. This is how far we've gone. <laughs> <laughs> show them what show them what else we got. Oh, I made you buy my thing. <laughs> oh well. Yeah. I got this Brahmin handbag for four dollars. Can you believe that? It's like a nice tote one, and then these sides like snap in on the sides. It just needs to be oiled. It looks like she had it kind of in her closet. It's like a little dusty, but it's super clean. And you know what the best part is? I can fit more stuff in it today. Like as I'm shopping, just keep stuffing it full. <laughs> Columbia shirt for my husband. It was a dollar. It's like that nice material that I don't have to iron. And this one's kind of neat. It has this uh, thing around the collar so you don't get sunburned. Mom. I got some page bell <laughs> bottoms. I just have to hem. Yeah. For ten dollars. Ten bucks for page jeans. For page jeans, and I got a little blanket for my my son Sherman, and I got him another toy. Duh. <laughs> All right, back on the road, mom. Yep. Two for fifty bucks. Look at those. Those are cool. Yeah, that's neat. It's fake, Fendi. I picked it up, but it's like super light. Otherwise, it's like, oh, are you kidding me? It's like faint right now. <laughs> oh, that's pretty. What is it? Like the whole bed set? King pillow sham. All, all Battenberg lace. Lots of pillow shams. Curtains. <laughs> <laughs> You're never cute. <laughs> this is so pretty. Look at that. I don't have a spot for it, but it's gorgeous. Aren't those pretty? Mom, these are neat, like blown glass ones. Look, can you hold them in the light? Yeah. Okay. Pink ones, Mom, would match my living room or my dining room, huh? Dollar vine. A vine or is the whole thing? I don't know. Make a garland. I was just thinking how these would be neat, like on the um, on the mantle or something, to make like a a garland over them for the fall. I wonder if she'd do five bucks for the box. Blue and red looks pretty. Those are pretty, I like the shape, Mom. Okay. How much are those ones? Dollar each. Get two of those and then you have two blues and two reds. Yeah, I just got the two blues like it. I guess those are neat. Yeah, they are. wow, this one's super organized. Shoes are only $2 or three for five. Look at my mom's hands are full. This sale's really good. I'm trying really to find good. the biggest bag in here. <laughs> Maybe we could cram them in. Luckily, a lot of people have recycled tubs, but look at all the cute tops my mom got. Basically, they're like $2 a piece. Oh, here's that one. Look at that one. I got hearts on it and stuff. Look at my mom's. Show them your shirts, mom. We lay them down here and then we can look at them. We owe her 24 because we got 10 things. Ugh. So adorable. Look at that. 
Ooh, look Anything at that one with the embroidery sleeves, Mom. Yeah. Beautiful. That one's from Sundance. Out. It's like a nice thermal. <laughs> Mom's trying to figure out where we are. Oh, we're five, <laughs> five, eight, nine. We just go go straight that way, Derek. Our. We got an entire bag of really cute clothes for twenty-four dollars. Like, yeah. you can't even beat that. Can't even buy. Now we have our arms full, and we need to go back to the car yeah. and drop things off. <laughs> I feel like I gained like sixty pounds right now of it's, stuff yeah. I don't need. <laughs> You're probably carrying it. <laughs> Karen. These are gonna be, everyone was looking at me like, why did I buy these dilly weeds? But you wait and see, they're gonna look they're so gonna cool. They're looking to kill on your stairway. I'm thinking in the dining room. This is, you walk out on the road, you walk yeah. on the sidewalk. This is the hard part, cause like, you'll walk, you keep going to these sails, and then you gotta walk all the way back to your car. Okay, so the plan is now we're gonna go drop all of our stuff back into the car, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna drive a little further into the into the heart of the garage sale beast. Yeah, we only got the, the <laughs> eight, we only got to uh, eight hundred. Yeah, like we how much what fifteen percent of the garage sales we've seen. Yeah, it's a good day. <laughs> we finally made our way back to the car. We had to walk like eight miles. <laughs> it felt like it. Um, so I brought a like plastic tote with me here in the car really just things. to like kind of help keep things like if we get breakable stuff we can keep it in there and uh this is all closed so that's now it's the fun game of car tetris so yeah i tried to put all the clothes in there Mom. yeah that's gracie's yeah don't get hers mixed up with ours okay, take unload hers all my garden garden garland i'm getting all my doggy stuff out Okay, so the plan is we're going to unload all of our bags and stuff, and that way we can still have our, our recycle stoats to use. Let's take that with us. Glorious dilly weeds. Whew. Do you know how much these would be at the craft store? Yeah. She'd probably make like $100 for all these weeds. <laughs> I just... She, she didn't even want to know how many. I said, can would you take five for all this? She said, yeah. She didn't care. She wanted them gone. Yeah, she wanted new for next Christmas. Did you hear that one lady? She said, she's all, everything's two for a dollar. And if you get one thing, I'm still going to charge you a dollar for it. So you better get two. <laughs> I, want to take it back. I wanted to talk with you. I'm trying to make sure I don't have granola in my teeth right now. Um, we were smart this year. Last year, we heard, I don't even think we ate breakfast. My mom brought oatmeal raisin cookies. So we called that our breakfast. And we were so hungry at the end of this. But this year I brought those, like they're called prescription bars. They're like a protein What's up? Oh, that's not my mom. They're like a protein granola bar. And they're really, really good. And they're like fruit and nut. Mm. So it's perfect. And we got our water jugs. My mom brought her little cooler. Like this is not our first radio. This is our second. <laughs> so uh, my mom just popped out of the car to go look at a piece of artwork real quick. And I, I saw a spot to park. So we're getting into the area where the sales are kind of spread apart a little bit. So I have to be like strategic, you know, and make my mom jump out if she sees something. I want to see what this was. Oh, it's a dress. We're not gonna get you one. That's pretty dress. You could do that, you're skinny. It's pretty purple, look at it. Yeah, it is. Maybe a pretty Christmas dress. Christmas time. What else is in here? In your back spasm? I, I just I just took a um pill though. Ooh, more beads. They're little pants. Uh-oh. Kind of, your, the crotch is down to your knees, though. You like that dress, Dean? I don't think, I do like it, but I don't think I would wear it. What is this one? I like looking in little bags, because you just never know what you're going to pull out. <laughs> Oh, well, that's pretty. Look, it's like a little tank. Look at these. Oh, those are cool. Get rid of all my other dollar pig. Get rid oh, of Oh, get those. There's four of them. Those are rad, Mom. And they're nice, big, thick ones. Get rid of those little thin ones I got. Yep. Okay. Those are cool. My legs are tired. Are your legs tired? My, no, my back started acting yeah. up though. We're walking like turtles now, <laughs> like this. I'm gonna try to straighten up. <laughs> Look at this. We didn't show anyone, did we? 
Look at that shirt mom got. <laughs> I'm gonna so cute. Oh, look cool. It's really pretty. Okay, back in the car. Cute. Looks like we go in a row, I think. I'm keeping my elbows in. Oh, look at the big moth on it and stuff. That's so pretty. Oh my gosh, my mom has helped me plan this like Instagram reel I'm gonna make. That's red. And I needed a martini glass for the video I'm making. Yeah, look at those ones. Those yeah. are fun too. They're prettier. That's cool. This is martini though. Yeah. This is a dollar table. It's a dollar? I think this is. Oh my gosh, we're that getting dollar a, a dollar. Or you can get the blue ones. <sighs> it's a tough one. Should I get the two blue ones? I know this one. Or just the one, one, just that one giant one I think is, is great. Okay. That's perfect. Oh, it's going to be a good digger one. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that bedspread right there. This? Oh, that's a blanket, isn't it? Yeah. Blue and white things. There's a whole garage of Selena. blue and white. Oh, those are fabulous. Oh, I really like these, Mom. Look at those. They're like, what, from the 80s with little... Pearl. Oh, I love them. What is that work called? I got a purse like this one. Those are coming home. Made in the USA. She didn't. They're Red cute. Dogs. Love. Great find. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> so exciting. <laughs> Ooh, look at all these rugs. This little cottage one. That's cute. This would be nice by my side door. There's a twin. Oh, these are chair pads. I thought it was the twin thing for your bed, Grace. Look at these quilts. What kind of style are you going to do? Look at that. Might be a little twin cover look. Uh, yeah. Look how pretty. No, I bet it's not twin. It's queen. Did I tell you twin? You told me a twin, yeah. Okay. Okay. Wow. Look at the big peacock. Do you like that for your room? It's all made out of beads. Yeah. And look, I can't even handle this. Excuse me. Excuse me. Yeah. Oh, it looks dreams. like scary, doesn't it? I think there's one outside. That's when we brought that in. I can't. Sticking, <laughs> sticking out on the edge like that? Who's the lady who owns this place? My mom's going to find out. This is. How much are you asking for your mirror over here? The gold mirror right in front of me. I can't even. The gold one? Oh, okay. Mom, did you find her? 75 bucks. Sold. Sold $75. Oh, ah, for the dining room. Stunning, and I love to sell it while I'm here. Yeah. I just, I, I, you know, I just, I'd like to see it someplace where somebody would really cherish it. Yeah. That, yeah. Yeah. It's a two or three thousand dollar mirror. I, I live in an old Victorian house, and I was looking for something to go above a mantle. <laughs> it's absolutely yeah. unbelievable. I mean, here I. I don't even want to touch Yeah, I mean, I was just worried someone was going to bash into the yeah, top of that. Yeah, that's what I had. It's really heavy. I'd say, what, if you don't mind, can I get a number and then we can do this after the garage sale? And I'll, I'll, I'll bring somebody with me so we can pick it up really carefully. Yeah, I mean, I just... I don't want... I don't want to... It's, yeah, it's, it's, it's very heavy. Yeah. Well, we should at least lift it up because I'm no, no, so no, worried someone's going to someone's gonna kick this walk yeah, in my... Yeah, well, that's what I had. I had, um, I had, um, stuff here to do like a bucket. Boxes. I'll move this You thinking about your fireplace? Yeah, that's really neat. I missed out on one like this before. But that is, I can tell you that that is... The nicest thing she had to post. It's, I have pictures 
on it on the wall. Oh, cool. <laughs> I like that chandelier. I know it's really a big chandelier and the mirror. I'm serious because I want to. This do, do for my dining room. Someone put a modern fixture in it, yeah. and I like to have something a little more this fancy. This was in the house, the stage room. Yeah, here it's real yeah. crystal. Yeah, yeah, I love the big. Yeah. I look real pretty when yeah, the when sun comes through. Yeah, when they shipped this from the, from New York, they hand packed wrapped each everyone. One. That's good. And um, get all chipped up. so they got a really good deal because they knew the owner, one of the not the owner, one of the top executives. Um, yeah, this cool. is an antique. They bought that from an antique dealer in Manhattan in the 50s. Oh, cool. I bet your mom is so excited to bring that home. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, they hired a decorator. And to hang that, I bet. Oh, my God. Pete's yeah. going to be excited. Yeah. <laughs> so that's a big <laughs> thing to hang. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, that has to be, that should be bolted into the wall. Yeah. yeah. We, we do want you to know that we are very excited, but we are exhausted. Tired. <laughs> How long did we garage sale today? It was from 8 to 2. 8 to 2, and then we had to go back. And get some stuff we couldn't fit in the oh, car. Just wait till you see what I got. Oh my gosh. But we're gonna save that closer to the end of this video, of course. Totally save the best for last. Okay, Mom, what do you got? I got this beautiful shirt. That's really cute. I'm glad you got Ooh, look at the sleeves. Yeah, that's Did you why see I like satin? that's why I liked them. Mom, that's really cool. I like that they were bell ones. Yeah, you could even wear this like open like a cardigan yeah, too. Yeah, it has the little tie in the back. That's cute. How much was this one? I don't even remember. I think this was like $3. Oh, that's pretty, Mom. Yeah, I really like that. Gorgeous. Yeah. Oh yeah, these are the shoes. I didn't show you. Um, we're gonna do this all out of order, I'm sure, but um, this was at the most amazing garage show we went to. These were the woman's mother's shoes. I don't know what year they are. I had, um, little purses made of velvet. I was told they were from the 40s, the purses I had. They're made in Spain, it says. Oh, these are? This says made in USA. Oh, her Maybe boxes. the box was made in Spain. <laughs> but look at that, with the gold threading, and these these are real little seed pearls on there. I just thought these are super pretty. They're like perfect, look like she wore them one time, so those will be fun to wear this winter. And these are only $4. Got my little Sherman, it was a baby blanket, but he'll love it, it's furry. Set that on the chair of the ottoman so he can cuddle for a dollar. What did you get for me? What did I get for you? Nothing. Yeah, you're grown. <laughs> Sherman's See, I told you. <laughs> He's my little baby. She only gets things for Sherman now, not me anymore. Yeah. The, look at this Brahmin handbag, you guys. I actually didn't even end up filling this up. I thought I would at the sale, but I came, I parked it back in the car again and forgot but it would have been good to carry more treasures in but this just needs to needs to be cleaned it's just like a little bit dusty but it, these part, bits like fold in on the side she said to kind of make like a different like tighter looking bag but like look at that even the bottoms in like gorgeous condition yummy chocolate color for fall oh yeah my mom said she had one of these jackets in the 70s. Yeah. I'm probably going to wear this like for one of my um, photo shoots for my website. And then I'll probably have it like in one of my closet sales at some point. Because it's not, I've, obviously I don't wear a lot of like bohemian and 70s stuff. But like the texture will look really cool. Oh dang, this fits me good. good. Should I wear this? <laughs> yeah. I think, what if like with my hair down though and some turquoise jewelry some on? Jeans and on. lace, like if you mix lace with this. So this is pretty cool. Yeah, I like the mine. back is really neat though. Look at that. That's not a uh, reproduction. That's the real thing. The real used deal. To wear. You had one in like every color, didn't you? Have a I, light. I had a light color one. Chocolate and, and black, right? Yeah. yeah, my mom had all of them. I used to be into western that wear when cool. I was little. Feel like fringe. Ooh, I gotta take this off though. It's summertime. And it's warm. <laughs> I got another doggy toy. You need to calm down. And then I actually got another one that snuck in my bag. Too. Surprise! <laughs> so he's got two, three things. <laughs> this one girl had like all of her clothes, clothing was a dollar. So I got these shorts. They're from Splendid. They're kind of short. It probably won't be in the front yard like weeding in these, but but I will be in the backyard. <laughs> bending over. <laughs> bending I, will over be, I will be back there. Traffic jam out here. <laughs> <laughs> so I got those ones and then she had this uh, free people top that I thought was kind of cute because it had adjustable straps look it's just like a little camisole it's nothing fancy but it's cotton for summer I thought it would be nice it was a dollar oh get those down here this is spectacular so I ended up getting like a couple things from this lady's sale so this I think ended up being like ten dollars 
for this. Um, but this is a real chinoiserie one and it look up close. It's all, see that beading? It's all hand painted on there. Really beautiful, lots of detail in this one. And what's really cool about these old ones is look inside, even that inside's beautiful with the goldfish. Super gorgeous. And then um, thanks to you guys out here who know your glassware, crazing on the bottom. I learned that word, it's called crazing. Not raisin, crazing. Crazy. When the glaze has that Crack crackle. crackle. Yeah. Look at that. And I got a heating <laughs> pad <laughs> for bad backs that I have. <laughs> For her three dollars, the old man that I got it from, he told me he updated. He has a full body heating pad. Uh. It's like four foot long. He says that mine's perfect now. And he says I can lay on it. I can put it in my chair. And it covers my whole body. Jealous. I'm jelly. <laughs> <laughs> totally jealous. Oh, this was from. Okay, this one's cool. My mom's like, you gotta put that back. <laughs> This was from the same lady's sale where I got the chinoiserie pot. She said that her mom traveled a lot. So this one was basically from an estate sale is what it was. Um, and the whole garage is packed with stuff. If you remember back at that one that had a lot of really neat older, like the blue and white stuff. And then um, you, I can't, I'm just like total hazed right now from over garage sale overstimulation. That's what it is. But she told me that this is a fertility vase. <laughs> My mom's like, oh, you better Great. put that back and have all these babies. But look at look at the beautiful like detail in this one. Look at that. It has like big moths all over it. Gorgeous botanicals. I just thought this was so cute with all these like little babies like craw crawling all over the vase. <laughs> well, that'll be pretty with my garden roses though. So my mom's scared of it. <laughs> uh, got me some page bell bottoms. Everybody knows I love my bells. So I got some page bell bottoms and I paid ten dollars for them. <laughs> oh, don't make fun of that. That was an accident. Bottom. Get rid of your ratty old nightgown now. That was kind of ugly. Don't show that one. What's a charter club? You still don't like this one? No, I don't like it. <laughs> some things we don't show they're ugly. <laughs> She's serious. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, my neighbor was walking by and I didn't want her to watch my haul. <laughs> I got Pete this Columbia shirt for a dollar. It's like that really lightweight material that doesn't doesn't wrinkle for a buck. Oh, and then, oh, you got those things. Well, an, uh, another video we showed some glasses I got for uh, 25 cents each. Well, I updated again already. Got these ones. They're that really chunky yeah. stuff. Hold them up to the sunlight so they see that the amber. Yeah, it's like root berry yummy. For a dollar a piece. Those are cool, Mom. These are better than the ones I got for a quarter, so the quarter ones are gonna go for donation. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> mom, my mom upgraded her garage sale find. I got this one for four dollars. That didn't, I need to button the front, but I thought it was nice. It's like a really long maxi dress and it's like a linen material. I think, I feel like linen is something that is okay if it's wrinkled, so I'm a fan of that. But adjustable straps, it's a nice long length with buttons. Dude, this one. Oh yeah, this, this one I tried on. And my mom spotted this, she's like, look at that coat. This one's cute. Look at this. Patchwork, somebody made a, a coat out of patchwork quilt. That is cute, it's like duster like for fall, like wouldn't that be really cute? No pocket. Oh, she should have put a patch pocket on there. No inside either? No. Wow. That, it would be cool if she had a patch pocket on But it is very cute, isn't it? A little bell sleeve. <laughs> so, um, we uh, pulled up to this one garage that had like, they had some tents outside and lots of clothing racks. And as we like approached the garage, it was a full on boutique in there. Like everything was size, small, medium, large. They had like pajama section, accessories. It was like a real boutique. Yeah, in, our, in their garage. Yeah, it was super cool. And so there was literally clothing of all sizes and all styles because a whole bunch of women donated to this particular garage sales, like a fundraiser. And so the clothing, $2 a thing, anything. Two Anything. Bucks. Look at that. And this is a brand new <laughs> Sundance thermal shirt with embroidery. I love embroidery. That. Embroidery. For winter time, that'll be great. Sundance is expensive, Mom. This is only $2. Two bucks. That's cool. Then I got this shirt. So I can wear this with my white pants or leggings. It's like it's, a tunic. Yeah, and it's all embroidered. Is that some fancy designer? And it's lined. 
That's what I like. It was lined. I don't know. G collection. G -collection. <laughs> we don't know. <laughs> but it's really pretty. <laughs> Lottie Dog collection. <laughs> Got this little shirt. It's embroidered across the top too and, and olive green. It's kind of pretty color. Oh that one's really pretty mom. That's look at the embroidery work on that. I'll hold that up close so they can see. Look at that's like really good. This is hand done, not machine embroidery, you know? Two bucks. That's really cute. Mom. Yeah. Cute for fall. And she got this one that's like a really pretty. This is actual linen, isn't it, Mom? Like a good. Looks like it. Isn't that? Yeah. Oh, that goes with your pants you're wearing. Cool. Yeah. Here, put that in your pile. Monday. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. This one's vintage. Look at that one. This is a really nice, like, gauzy linen. Look at the cute little, look at the cute little things. Little ties. I love that one. That's really pretty. I feel like that would fit me, too. Probably would. Cute. Probably would fit you better than me. So my, well, you cut. take it, and then if it doesn't fit you, then you can give it to me. <laughs> this one, this one is really cute. It's not my size, but I feel like I like my blouses to be a bit oversized. So when you tuck them in, I like that kind of more billowy full look. But imagine, look at this. This is from what Ann Taylor. Look at the sleeves. Great big full sleeves, and it's got that ruching where it's elastic, like a Victorian kind of style. I was thinking, I'm gonna wear this with like my black high waisted jeans tucked in. If I could find a red belt, I need a red belt. Yeah. So bad. We should have looked for one today, but I was just like in the blur, you know? This is $2 from Ann Taylor. This one, I felt like this was some kind of brand I've seen at Nordstrom or something. But this was just like a tunic length. Um, What's this called? Thermal? Thermal. Oh look, it has little buttons on it. I didn't even see that. That's kind of cute. But just, you know, just to be casual in the fall, it's a great color. Yeah. It's too oh, these are real cute. Look at these paper bag waist jeans. I don't know if these will fit. They look really small, but they were stretchy. So I was like, oh, I'm just going to chance it for two bucks. But look at that. These have like a little ruffle there. I thought that was adorable. Little skinny jeans. Oh yeah, I hope these fit too. These overalls. I thought were really neat because uh, they look like jeans, you know, like they're not like the baggy ones, like men's ones that are like really baggy in the butt and stuff. These are like more of a fitted look, you know, with the little zipper here and stuff. Like a fit, they were from Lucky Brand. So I hope they fit me too, because I thought that would be real cute in the fall. Oh, that was like the first thing I got, huh? Like the first big thing? Yeah. This, remember that? <laughs> I bet you're in a garage sale haze with us too. Like you remember all this stuff. <laughs> Um, but this one I ended up getting for $15 and it has all these little people around it. Look at that. And the little chains. This thing might be really beautiful with perfume bottles on the top of it. I'm in a, I have a, one of those stand up jewelry boxes in the guest room and I was thinking like on top of that I could put my little perfumes and stuff but I just thought that was really really pretty. Kind of unique looking with the ladies. Oh yeah she gave me a note on this. She said this was called like Mosier glass. And it's all cut. There's one small chip here. But see Those that? are something bohemian enamel overlay. Yeah. Cut glass. Then there was the decant the top too was really yeah, see in there. The top had like some kind of like mercury hopefully not mercury glass, I guess, but it had something silver in the she said it was like unique to this kind of glassware. Look, see that silver. Oh, there's thing like in little there? Or is that just the blown part of the glass? I, I don't know. Something in there. It's really heavy. Like, look at this. Can you see that in the topper? See those things? It, they look silver in the light, but maybe it's just the blown part of the glass. So yeah, it's not signed or scratched anything, but that was so pretty. I'm not, I usually don't collect like glassware type stuff, but this was really unique and I feel like it's super old and it's probably valuable. <laughs> so that'd be fun to research. This one, remember my little thing that I made in the springtime? I had the um, little Venetian glass sprays and then mine have mine has like big uh, pink flowers on it and stuff. But this is only a dollar. And the people at the garage sale, they were like, what is that? They didn't even know what it was and that was their mom. So they were really excited that I knew what it was. And I was telling them like, oh, I have one they put little roses in and stuff. So they were, they were excited that it was going to me, who knew? <laughs> but it was only a buck. Look at this one. That was one of the first like things that I got when we started treasure hunting. But that's kind of pretty, right? <laughs> it's like super pretty. Looks like the little safety chain I need to repair on there, but 
it looks like the um like the 1940s german jewelry with all of that kind of like filigree type work but a lot of detail in that one i thought that was gorgeous oh you got a toothbrush thing Ma. i got a toothbrush holder to put my toothbrush in that's super pretty usually i have it in something funky but so now i'm going to update yeah yeah i don't even know what's going on at your house now Jeez. what do you have in there <laughs> <laughs> i got these two these are more modern rings. I don't think they're like old, old, but they're sterling. And this is peridot and this is moonstone. Look, it's like a little spinner ring. That's kind of fun, huh? These were neat too. This this is when I was checking out and this lady brought up a um, shoe box full of jewelry. So I was just kind of digging around in that. But I found this. It's like a squash blossom, but it's very glamorous. So that has real turquoise and garnets in it. And then I don't, this little bead chain's kind of funny. It's like one of those lamp pole things. So I'll probably end up putting this on a different chain because the pendant is what the cool part of this. And then this piece was also, this was signed. Um, I don't know what it says. I'll have to get my little loop out, but it's all enamel. Isn't that kind of fun too? It's like 60s, I think. Oh yeah, Limoges. Everyone knows Limoges is fancy. Look at that all hand painted little Limoges trinket dish. Oh, that's nice. She taped the lid for me. But it says something on the bottom. Oh, somebody got it for Christmas. The best antiques are old friends hand painted by Mary, especially for Jean, Christmas 1990. Her friend hand painted this. Wow. The best antiques are friends. That's cute. And then I got Balik. I've, there were ladies when I worked at the antique shop that collected Balik and they were like, if you ever see it, always pick it up because it's like very collectible. And I remember at the antique shop, the, the teacups alone were like very expensive. So I'm not sure what this little dish would be for, but it was really cute because it has a little shell type design and it almost has like a pearl finish when you hold it up to the sun. And then this is the little creamer. Millie, that's picture. the Sherman's. What would this be for, do you think? What do you think this little bowl is for, Mom? I don't know. Cube sugar? Cream Maybe it was cubes? cream and sugar or anything. That'd be a good idea. It's really pretty. Mom and I are here to tell you bye. <laughs> <laughs> We're bye. We're tired. <laughs> We're so tired. But we hope you had fun with us too. And stay tuned for my next video because I'm going to show you how I put all of these beautiful things in my home and style up the clothing. That's going to be so fun. But before we do that, I want to show you the most exciting part of this entire garage sale day. Are you ready for this? I'm standing in front of the most amazing thing. It's like a forever thing that I will have forever until I die and someone's lucky enough to buy it from my estate sale because this thing is incredible. So on the way home, I did some research and found out that it's from the 18th century, 18th century, which means like 1700s, and it's called a cushion mirror and this is French, so check it out. <laughs> wow glory so we had to drive all the way back home and pick up pete my husband and the pickup truck so we could get this beauty home but look at that isn't this incredible oh look at the gilding the crest so i'm thinking i'm going to put this over top of the fireplace and then move the bird somewhere else special in the living room but this is just going to look so pretty in between my sconces i feel like and I just couldn't believe that this was on the garage floor when we got to that estate sale. And I'm really excited that it'll be home with us now in a forever spot.